Hey guys, this is Handful, uh, doing another Spin Tires tutorial. Going to show you guys how to make sure your maps and mods work properly. Been getting a lot of people telling me it doesn't work for them, and I am going to show you why it doesn't work for you. Alright, so uh, let's make sure all your, your mods are unactive. Deactivate them. Also, make sure that you are in the Spin Tires Legacy version. Okay, I must say Legacy there to show you how to do that later. If, uh, if you don't know how, I've got a video, you can see that. Anyway, um, what we're going to do now is get yourself a map. Alright, go download go download a map. I, I downloaded Proseca. I don't know if you guys have tried that map, it's a great map. Um, a lot of times people won't be able to get it to work, and I'll show you why you can't get it to work. So, what we're going to do is, I'm going to show you real quick how the file system should look. So, right now, all your mods go into the mods folder. Your mods are all labeled here with a name for the mod. Now, if you go and do this zip real quick or look into the zip, you notice it unzips with no name. So we have obviously got to create the name of the folder, right? We're going to name it Map Proseca. Let's just do that. All right, Map Proseca. So we got it named now Map Proseca. And most people would probably just drag and drop these folders in there. You know, let's just do that real quick. We're going to drag and drop those folders in there. All right, we're just dragging and drop those in there. That's We're going to think this mod, this mod works. This map's going to work, right? Well, this is what's going to happen. Let me show you what's going to happen real fast. So this is how our main folder looks. All right, when we go to, to uh, JSGME, the mod enabler, Map Proseca is there. It's there. We did name a folder in the mods folder map Proseca, so it is there now when we go to enable this watch this look what it did over here in this folder see what it did over here it put classes levels meshes and textures now it is not supposed to go in this folder if your folder looks like this in any way I'll show you the fix disable the mod should take it all back out. Looks good and clean now. This is how it should look. Now what we do is we got to go back into that folder where Prosecco was. Notice how when I click on the map name it goes straight to classes, levels, meshes, textures. Alright. It has to go to media folder here. There has to be a media folder. It has to access the media folder first. So media folder. Now these go in the media folder. All right, all the rest of those go in the media folder. So the way it should look is the name of the map or mod, media folder, and then all the other folders within that. Okay. Now when we go to load this, let me just go back here and I'll show you. Now when we go to load this, you notice it does not load anything in there it loaded it in the media folder where it's supposed to. That's where the game recognizes the mods and the maps. So that's the key point there, okay? So your mods folder, mod name or map name, media, then all the folders within that. Now, um, just to kind of show you real quick, if I were to deactivate this well, let's look, media, so right, look, this is all that's in there right now in the media folder. When you deactivate a mod, when all mods are deactivated, I should say, this is how your media folder should look. So if you've deactivated mods, you've tried removing mods, and you have folders in here besides videos, that's going to be your problem. Remove everything besides videos, just leave videos, you should be good. Okay. And then as long as you come up over here, go into your search real quick, or your run, whatever it is, and you do percent app data percent, go into your app data roaming file, go to spin tires, and delete this mesh cache. That mesh cache will make sure that the next mods you load in or next maps you load in load clean 
and that file recreates itself upon startup of the game every single time so you don't have to worry about it crashing your game you can go ahead and delete that so that should basically be it hopefully that should help you guys get your mods and maps working uh, maps mods both work through the uh, JSGME so Hopefully you guys like that. If you do, please like or hit the like button. And uh, if you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and subscribe. Uh, but uh, peace out.